My name is Eduardo Rojas. I've been a program leader here at the Together for almost a year now. And I am the advisor and director for the podcast club here at Portola. Since starting the podcast club, it kind of was a, it was a rocky start. It was something completely new to me especially and to the other PLs. So when we had the idea of having this come to life, it was actually one of our students uh, who had the idea. I wanted to help other people out there to let them know that they're not alone, but I didn't know who to do it with. So I asked my friends and they, they wanted to do this thing. We had no idea how we were going to go about it. We didn't know what equipment we were going to buy. We didn't know where to upload it or if anyone was ever going to listen to it. Like from the ads or commercials or stuff like that, I heard that it's mostly like adult because we're the first ones that we've done this. So uh, we went into it with positive vibes and high hopes that you know uh, the students were definitely going to have fun with it. So just seeing the growth of each student, whether they're an editor, a host, or just simply a writer. It helped me bring like the best of me. Teamwork was something that helped me, and I guess a little bit of leadership. It's just so rewarding to see that so many of the students have just grown socially, emotionally. They've grown as just a human being. Uh, I've seen themselves be so much open just because the podcast gives them an opportunity to be uh, expressively open with themselves. I'm still getting used to the fact that we're talking in microphones and, you know, like, one's on the other side. And it has impact in many ways, actually. We got to communicate, like, with, with one of the virtual kids. They, we actually got, like, a chance to, like, how we should communicate. Even either either of those sometimes we have like technical issues or like network issues. We still like try to communicate in many ways, like either it's like FaceTime or meets or like just like This has grown so much as individuals and uh, the podcast itself has definitely grown. We've seen the growth in numbers of so many people who have been interested in listening to us and I definitely see it going further and continuing after I'm gone or when we have our eighth graders gone.